TV watchers, today we're at Jamestown College. I'm Nicole Aaron for University TV. You're late. We're just about to start this tour. If only Jimmy was here. Jimmy, what are you doing? All right. Jamestown College is located in Jamestown, North Dakota. The rural city lies in the middle of the state and is full of outdoor recreational opportunities. There's a frisbee golf course out there. We have also another frisbee golf course in town. Uh, two golf courses, um, there's hiking trails actually around the reservoir as well, and running trails for that matter. So we'll go out there, go rollerblading, all that kind of fun stuff, go swimming. You can also find the world's largest buffalo right here in Jamestown. Jamestown's 110 acre campus has an Ivy League setting with a mix of historical and new buildings. Plus, the wooded campus overlooks the city, which is split by the James River. JC enrolls 1,000 students from 31 states and 13 countries. Guys and girls are split 50-50. The student-to-faculty ratio is 13 to 1, with an average class size of 18. JC has people from all over, and it's, it's interesting to learn about um, where they come from and your interests. We have a lot of foreign students. We have students coming in from Korea. Um, we have people from Africa. Great for you know, you're friends with kind of everybody, so. To gain entrance into Jamestown, the college requires a minimum composite ACT score of 18, or an SAT of 850, and a GPA of 2.5. Annual tuition for Jamestown is significantly lower than a majority of the nation's private schools, charging around $17,500, plus about $2,500 for room, and another $3,200 for board. Does the cost still seem too steep? Nearly 100% of JC students receive scholarships and institutional financial aid. Annually, the college awards $7.25 million. We have an endowment that our alumni has, has been gracious in funding, and we scholarship heavily. There are over 40 majors at Jamestown. The most common are nursing, education, and business. They have the first four-year nursing program in the state and an award-winning Convergence Student Media Center. Old programs don't mean old facilities. Nursing students use this state-of-the-art simulated intensive care unit to get hands-on training. The unruined Sheldon Center is one of the most wired and high-tech buildings in the Midwest. It houses the Department of Business, Economics, Accounting, Computer Science, and Information Technology departments. Pretty cool. One thing that's really been open to my, opened my eyes with James Hall College is that they've really prepared me that I can do anything I want. The faculty, the staff, and all the other upperclassmen as well are really concerned about the well-being of the freshmen, and they take care of them. We've actually even coined a term for our approach to education, and we call it the journey to success. Not sure of your degree path? Jamestown's Journey to Success program prepares students for rapidly changing environments through five elements a combination of liberal arts education and professional preparation, more personalized advising and career counseling, first-year student mentors, a proven placement service, and guaranteed internships and guaranteed graduation in four years. We do promise every student that if they want an internship that we will make that happen for them. So there's a lot of local internship possibilities as well as throughout the nation and some foreign internship possibilities. Jamestown employs 58 full-time professors and 28 part-time faculty members. 92% of the classes are taught by full-time faculty, all of which offer one-on-one -on -one advising. I can say lots of good words about the faculty here. Just really exciting, all down to earth, willing to help. Um, just go above and beyond to make sure uh, each student succeeds. They all know their stuff, they're all really good teachers, and they all love being here in Jamestown. It's a good place to be if you want your professors to care about you. Jamestown College has a long-standing reputation for an excellent athletic program. The 17 Jimmy's athletic teams compete in the NAIA division. Let's go to the concession stand. I'll buy you a hot dog. There are seven residence halls on campus, two of which are first-year halls, Watson and Cruzy. All students are required to reside on campus their first two years, plus parking and laundry are free. I love that students live on campus, and I think it's really important, at least your first two years, because then you get to meet more people. Like, the girls that were in my hall freshman year are my best friends now. I've had so much fun this year, just meeting all the girls, and even, like, walking through the other halls, too. Like, you get to meet 
the whole dorm just by being in a residence hall. Want to keep a busier schedule than you already have? Then pay a visit to the Office of Student Life to find out about the more than 40 clubs and organizations on campus. Or you can hang out here with me. There's lots of intramural programs, um, there's faith-based activities, and also activities that are really tied to their major. There's a ton of clubs and organizations, intramurals, like different major clubs, so that's really fun. And then there's just always something going on on campus. If the organization you want to become a member of doesn't exist, create it. Student government and community service are some options, and the choir performs internationally. Alumni include Barbara McClintock, an award-winning illustrator of children's books. Dr. Richard Army is the former U.S. House Majority Leader, and James Unruh is a former CEO of Unisys Corp. From a historical nursing program with prestige to high-tech facilities, Jamestown College excels across the board. You won't be lost in the herd if you choose to attend. I have never met a student who has been disappointed coming to Jamestown College. Well, Jimmy, I'm exhausted, but I'm so excited that we got to tour this beautiful campus. So remember when you come to Jamestown, your journey to success begins here.